Now it's fair to say that hotels in Benidorm fluctuate. You can pay quite a lot and you can also pay a really good price. But how cheap can you get it? I've been scrolling through the internet to try and find the cheapest hotel that I can find on this date and I think I found it. Not quite sure what to expect obviously being a cheap hotel so I do get worried about is it going to be clean, is it going to be dirty. It is in the old town so it will be down some back street but let's see what it's like and you won't believe the price. Come on. So let's head in to the old town by the way it would really help me out if you could hit that subscribe button so if you see it down there it's free to do just make sure you hit it so i'm looking for the hotel iris which should be down some of the back streets of benedorm but it's really confusing you can get lost around here my google maps say it's up here Oh, there it is. I can see it just there. Well, it's a little bit out of the way. All I know is there is a little restaurant in there, I believe, or a bar. I've booked a, a twin room. It does have a bathroom as well. Let's go and check it out. I guess this is, is this the entrance? Hola. Is this where I check in? Yes, what is the name? Okay, so Do I could you know get robbed out here or rob, robbed, robbed in the, in new, the town? new town? Not here, around no, here? No, up to now no one has ever got robbed here. Oh, okay, right, okay. But that to doesn't mean to say you should be, you should let your guard down. Okay, right. Anywhere in Benidorm, they just came to him, gave him a cuddle, he said his trousers were zipped, they opened the trousers so quick, giving him a cuddle, and everything went. Wow. Yeah, and I don't pockets. want to know about this. At four o'clock in the morning, we had to help him. We took him to the police station because he can't speak the language. What I'm trying to say, the point I'm making is be very careful. Okay. Okay. That. Now we've got grilled doughs because balconies are quite low and we've never had any problems. So we've, I've given you a room this side. Yeah. Okay. And the grilled doughs are locked. So brilliant. you can sleep peacefully. Okay. Now first floor, room 101. Okay. And brilliant. I've left the door open for you. Oh, fantastic. Okay. Thank you very much. Turn the light on. Magic. I can't say that I've ever checked in to a hotel before and they've been giving me warnings about robberies. But, very nice lady, and I guess she's just looking out for me. I kind of feel that this hotel has attracted younger guests before who like to go out and completely get drunk and come back. So I don't think they're like that anymore. So if you're one of those people, you know, they won't let you stay here. Not anymore. I think, I think they've had some bad experiences in the past. They, there was lots of warnings around reception and one that said, I'll have to pay if I soil the bedding. They use the word soil. So obviously they've had problems here. Anyway, let's check out the room. Very dark in here. I'm gonna open the curtains up in a minute, but it looks clean. Let's have a look at the view. Now, apparently these are here for safety. Again, for people stealing stuff out of your room. Not much of a view. But, you know, it looks all right. Now, being from the UK, I remember Tesco having a similar floor to this <laughs> back in the 90s. Tiny little seating area. That looks pretty dirty. No drawers, though. Not that you probably need drawers. I've got some fresh towels that smell all right. Somewhere for my luggage. I've got a plug socket down there, but why is it all the hotels that I've stayed in recently at Benidorm? The plug socket's just on the right-hand side and not on the left. Interesting. It's actually quite a low bed. Check it out. I've got a built-in wardrobe. Now, this is crazy, but I've actually stayed in more expensive hotels and had less wardrobe space. Plenty of shelves, nice big wardrobe. I've even got a blanket there if I get cold. Bed test. This is 
really comfy. Do you know what? This is perfect just to get your head down. Look at that. One long pillow. I kind of do like them. Well, bed linen. Nice and clean. There's only one little mark there. Just looking at the mattress actually. Bit at the top of there if anyone has a accident in the night. But yeah, that looks nice and clean. The room does come with air conditioning, which does work. Hang on a sec. Why is there two corks in it? I can't feel anything coming out of there. Oh, I can. Oh yeah, it's kicking out now. I also have a TV. TV works. Let's check out the bathroom. Nice mirror here. Look at that, spotless. There's the light. Hang on. That took a while. And here's the bathroom. They've even given us some complimentary soap and some shower gel. Power outlet in here and the shower. Look at that little mini bath. <laughs> that is so cute. Shower head, lovely and clean. Little bit of a window there. I would say you can get two people in that shower quite comfortably. Close that up. Do you know, when I first came in, I was actually expecting the worst. I could almost imagine a really grotty room for this price, but I'm very surprised. It's actually a really clean room. Now, all the hotels around here are Spanish run and Spanish owned, but apparently this is British. I didn't know that when I booked. Not that that makes any difference, but I just thought I'd let you know that. I mean, this has got everything you want if you want a cheap getaway here in Benidorm. Yes, it's not probably in the best area, but like the lady said downstairs, it is nice and quiet. The bed's comfy, the linen is clean, the towels are clean. And yes, the room is minimalistic, but you know, it is a very cheap hotel. So would you like to know how much I paid? In British money, I paid £33.57 a night. Now let's just put this into perspective. If you wanted to come to Benidorm for a few days, a getaway, get a cheap flight, you could do the whole thing for about 170 quid. If you wanted to stay for a week, less than 200. Amazing. I would definitely stay here again. If you would like to see my tour of Benidorm, make sure you click the video here. But if you would like to see a five-star hotel in Benidorm, make sure you click the video here. See what my money gets me. Do give the video a thumbs up. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and I'll see you next time.